everyone. Awesome JW here. Exactly the same day as I've recorded my uh, chapter two video, but that'll be coming out soon. And so this is chapter three. Deep sleep. What's the time? Playtime! S M I L E every day. When you are down and out, don't be around and out. The smiley pointers in the sun. S M I L E every day. The wind's really scary. Okay, guys, I promise. All winds blow away. Eventually. Catnap! Please help us go to sleep, Catnap! We need it, Catnap! Please help us! Sleep! Sleep! Everyone knows Huggy Wuggy safe. and Poppy Playtime, but are your children safe from Playtime Co.'s latest toy? What you've seen here is Playtime Co.'s own Smiling Critters, a limited series cartoon meant to celebrate the release of the toys sharing its name. Yet both now face the fire sparked by the inclusion of one key member. This is Catnap. And like the others of his line, you just... Pull his little tail and seems innocent enough. However, parents across the country report their children experiencing strange and often violent nightmares. And beside them, their little grinning catnap doll. Now with controversy growing, Playtime Co. has announced the recall of all catnap toys from the Smiling Critters line. His image cleared from all promotional material. But damage already done, will disappearing be that easy? The exact cause of these incidents still unknown, only one thing appears glaringly certain. Your children are not safe with catnap. Ominous. I love it. Great. Great opening. Oh, I just realized I'm not in full screen. There we go. Are we in the perspective? Patna? Oh, he just threw us down here. Graphics are already better.
think I want to get up there. And I, great, I have to do this again. It's not that hard. Well, the blue hand's here. So far, this game is glitchy. So that's what's supposed to happen, so I just got it glitched, huh? I'm Bubba Bumblefint. Hey! I remember you! Why is there a phone ringing? Gregory? Look at the tube thing from the back wall. Ready? Ba boom You can use that battery to open the door. I swear, this is probably gonna be Catnap talking to us right now. Either that or it's Gregory. Either Gregory, um, Patnap, or the prototype. That's my guesses. Either Gregory from Five Nights at Freddy's, um, Patnap, or the prototype. That was weird. What did I do that for? Hey, I'm Chicken Chicken! Wanna go outside and hang out? Ah, uh, yes, it's very safe. Hello, my name is Elliot Ludwig. When you look around at the world today, what one thing do you think it needs more of? I asked around once, money. I never have enough. Understanding, I can never get any. 
faith, the common man has lost it. Each answer was different, and I could perhaps see some little truth in each, but I think each was also missing something. Something simple. You see, not one of them could muster a smile. A smile is hope. A smile is love. A smile is understanding. So creepy. And there is nothing more gratifying to my soul than being the reason for a child's smile. To be the spark that ignites all their hopes and dreams. For it is only through hopes and dreams that we may create a better world. One where our children need not be afraid. One where they are protected. After all, this company and its toys are nothing without them. These children deserve to smile. They deserve to love. And they deserve a safe home. That is why it is with enormous pleasure that as the founder of Playtime Co., I announce... Playcare! Our very own on-site orphanage. But it's not only that. It's a school, a playhouse, a place to belong. No. Our very own no. ecosystem Part beneath put the into this. Dedicated in there is good intention behind this, I think. a child's smile. It's teachers and counselors, mothers and fathers, until such a time they have all not of that much. in you. May play care bring joy, inspiration, and smiles to all who enter these doors. For what gives life its meaning if not a smile? Here? Oh, I think it is. A lot of loading in this game. Like that smoke. 
guess we're gonna have to go in here or something. Not ominous at all. Sweet home, man. Eh? Doesn't seem like home sweet home. Dang, I missed it. Is that home sweet home? Already been doing this for thirty eight minutes. How does this gas not affect me? Doesn't this gas, like, make you sleepy? How am I just fine? Tragic news this morning, as of 9.45 a.m., local authorities report that the body of a young boy has been found on the estate of the late Elliot Ludwig. Following recent events, Playtime Co. was asked for any comment regarding the discovery. This is what they have to say. Opening. Elliot Ludwig was a great man. Those who knew him understood he was not capable of violence. Let alone what was called harm. Had a deep love for children, making the actions of whoever pla uh, planted its body all the more sick. We look forward to clearing his name. Stay tuned for you. Field chase sequence coming. Despite Playtime's proclamation of Ludwig's innocence,
actually scared me. Ooh, this is really scary, actually. Built haunts you. Going in circles. So weird. I don't like how long this hallway is. And I don't like the children crying. Oh no, this does not make me feel good. Greetings, employees, and welcome to your first day here in Playtime. We're certain that in the days to come, you'll find your new Happy family here fun. every bit as loving and supportive Why as your own. Done? Feel free to wander the halls, sit in the mess for lunch, or watch our children play and learn to their little hearts' content. Join the innovationists where the bounds of science are continuously pushed. Or join the counselors of Playcare whose diligence and care for our children will help shape a brighter future. Just you see. Now, every one of you has your part in that future, so should you come back tomorrow feeling unhappy for where you are, or what you've done, worry not, for your supervisor is here and happy to listen. And, should you come back years later, your conscience finally getting the better of you, May you descend into the dark and the dust, finding all that awaits you are incomprehensible horrors, each hungry for your return, each eager that they might find you. I'm, Perhaps they'd it's forcing me to look smile at, it. at you from a shadow, their smiling mouths full of teeth and meat and plastic, watching and waiting patiently for their turn at a warm welcome. Or perhaps they won't allow you such time to figure your place in the world you'd left. A world that's theirs now. It doesn't even let me move the camera now. Welcome home. Uh, 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 uh. I thought I hallucinated. <laughs> that was honestly creepy. Oh. 
Oh, there's the red guy. I didn't even see that. Subject is stable. Designated 1322. Clear neural abnormalities were detected in his recent checkup. Though highly irregular, we've pulled him from What are you doing out of bed? How did you get in here? Is Kevin sick? Why did you take him away? I, I, yes. Kevin is very sick. Very, very sick. We want to make him better, but he can only get better if we take him to where we can provide proper care and give him proper rest. Well, do you really think he will be okay? I should think so. We're good at what we do, son. We paid attention in school, learned, and got our proper rest when we needed it. Just like you need it now, I should think. Come now, let's get you on back to bed. Okay. It's been a pleasure meeting you, Joseph. And I promise you, your friend will be all right. When you see him again, he'll have never been better. Salvation, the angel of salvation. Mm, yes, not ominous. I love how creepy this is. Love the vibes. Giving... Uh... Like, murder.
actually okay. here to help. <sighs> hey, this place that... makes her tense. Missy, Missy. I'm glad that Ollie could help you get this far. He's the reason we found you at all. Looks like the train crash hurt us both. You've been through so much. You deserve an explanation. Come on. Yes. Yes, I do. Hey, you'll be okay. We'll be okay. Let you leave. What's happening down here is bigger than all of us. And I need you. So we can get revenge on those monsters who've tortured you. Who've tortured us. They didn't act alone. They're disciples of the original. The prototype. Do the honors? Prototype knows we're coming by now. You try to escape, he'll kill you before you ever reach that front door. He's the reason I was trapped in that god awful case for so long. You have no idea of the things he's done. Let me help you kill him. Let me help you save everyone. We've all seen you, how capable you are. You killed Huggy, you killed Mommy. You freed me. You are perfect for this. Catnap is coming. He's the final obstacle the prototype has placed against us. We can't stay here. Keep yourself safe. Ollie will call you. Let me in. Oh. All right, guys. Right there. I feel like we need that loading screen now. This is a massive map.
This is Miss Delight speaking. Please excuse the interruption. Students, remain in your seat until the bell has rung. And no going in the halls without a hall pass. you? Yes, I remember. You used to work here. How are you? Alive. Hmm? Barb? Oh. Barb says you're looking for your co-workers. Catnap wouldn't like that you're here. You should leave. For your own safety. Not a good listener, are you? You're a lot like the other humans in that way. I wonder if your screams will sound like theirs too. <laughs> I look forward to finding out. Honestly, uh, she has a point. I have no clue how to get out of here. Students, find my sisters and I to learn facts across a variety of subjects. Press my button to hear some facts on anatomy. Ah, uh, classic poppy playtime. Oh my god. Oh, oh scared me. Oh, oh. oh scared me bad.
okay, okay, okay. How long is this segment going on? Okay, I'm looking at you. <laughs> you not tell me you have to do all that again. If I do, then this game is terrible and I'm calling it here. If not, then I'll finish the segment. All right, guys. Um, I really don't want to do all that again. Well.